hi guys welcome back here again to my channel so if you're new here welcome my name is Cynthia if you just join me here on this channel hey welcome 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 please take a seat and please before we continue I know this is about to be like a fun journey for you so please be cool my binu click on that subscribe button and also do not forget to hit the notification bell so you get notified whenever i post up a new video here so let's get into the main thing for today okay so in today's video i will show you guys how i was able to create this look using a drugstore eyeshadow palette guys look at this palette if you know what this palette has it has like what pretty colors pretty pretty colors I know you love it too like look at those pretty colors I wish I can swatch these colors for you guys to actually see but you know these colors are like the best I have actually seen in a long time this didn't really cost me so much money I got this for at least I think it was 500 or 600 naira you can't even get it for less a price or you know a bit pricier than that but to be honest with you this is what the buy so this is a charm look stay matte 12 color eyeshadow palette anyways I usually go for neutrals like this but today I am like you know I'm feeling this area like all this area in general like this is calling out my name so badly. Um, I think I've said so much about this and this, so we are just going to go ahead and dive into this video. So I just did my eyebrows off camera and we're going to dive into the next thing which is actually doing my eyeshadows It's actually raining right now. I'm going to try as much as I can not to let this rain You know spoil my day or end this video for me because I've been for a very long time Planning to film this video, but the weather hasn't been allowing me at all and today that I feel like I want to film this rain is here so um i just wanted to do more colors but um the colors here are really pretty but i'm scared i don't even know which and which to actually try to give me something good but let's just do something i feel really scared trying them out but i'm going to just try it you know there's no harm in trying at all so i'm going to try out the, this one here I'm going to use this as a transition color and I'm going to apply this all over my crease. my crease a little bit with my eyeshadow primer I would have used a concealer but I'm going to be using an eyeshadow primer today because I just want it to like stick out like going to dive into this very blue color get to the chunk of it and just tap on what guys I love what I love how this looks like I didn't put a primer first before this like I wouldn't know how much more this would actually look 
but it looks really perfect and I love it I do a lot guys and I don't even have to put so much it looks super cool look at that I'm in love people I'm so 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 in love okay so I'm going to line my lids let's just do this let's just do this like I'm now feeling this look and I'm feeling this makeup because if your eyes are looking great the rest of your look are certainly going to look perfect okay so I'm going to line my lids a little I'm going to put just tiny little bits of the liner because I don't want this liner to take everything away from this blue because this blue Okay, so we're going to go ahead and um, do foundation and then finally we can come back to my eyes later. So we're going to apply foundation. So one thing I want to do today is I'm going to apply my glow bronzer before I apply any foundation. So I'll be using my Usha um, Bronze Glow. I just threw my lashes on off camera. I have a detailed eyelashes tutorial video here on this channel. I'll be linking it up here or in the description box for you guys to actually check that out. So we're going to go ahead and apply some eyeshadow to my under eye area. So I'll be using this blue. Normally I would apply eyeliner to my under eye area but today we'll be doing this eyeshadow. I'm going to take some of this color that we did before. And I'm gonna smudge this here. Anyways, um, I like it. I'm gonna go ahead and do my lips um, and then finally finish my face. I'm going to line my lips um, with my lip liner here. guys I want to do a different lip color today like a very huge statement kind of lip um, color and I hope I don't hate it after applying it we're finally going to end up with this one this is like a red lipstick red for like a dark red I'm going to apply this okay so we're gonna do something to this lip I'm going to clean out the inner corners a little bit and yeah just apply some new to it okay I can just like now be apply my new lipstick in the center area okay I'm going to apply lip gloss to this Let's see how glossy Okay, fine.
highlights and this off I'm going to go back with this liquid bronzer that I actually did on my cheek before I applied my foundation obviously that didn't really pop out much right now the way I actually expected it to and that's like a zero zero no 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 for me I'm going to be doing just a little quantity today I just love how they pop up like on my forehead and then on my chin here like uh, this is absolutely beautiful I love 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 this so we're going to go ahead and slay my hair and we'll be right back to finish this video okay guys so I just slayed my hair I am back I actually love this look guys this look is making me feel so confident about myself just love it I'm going to come up Close so you guys can really see what's going on with this look for me talking about it you basically might not actually understand where I'm coming from with how much I love this I'm going to come close okay okay guys so um, look at this I just love the fact that I could actually see the red transition color that I actually used before um, I, I applied the blue one and then love how it was easy like it easily blended in and how it perfectly is sitting like, I've created looks before and sometimes when I create looks I feel like um, one or two ways there is a lot of problems with either the eyeshadow doesn't blend out well or something is a problem with it but this particular eyeshadow is giving me joy of how this finally came together please let me know what your thoughts are in the comments down below and you know do not forget to like this video also do not forget to click on the subscribe button if you just join me here for the first time i will see you guys in my next one and thank you so much for watching Mwah.